Hey there, it's Mercedes. Um, I wanted to show you guys today like what kind of hygiene and stuff I use. And so um, I have shampoo, face washes, face cleansers, um, face, um, I'm sorry, um, word I forget right now. I'll remember it when I show you the product. Toothbrush, toothpaste, deodorant, hair stuff, whatever. You may care, you may not. I'm going to show it to you anyway. So, um, first one I'm going to show you is stuff that I use in the shower. And so, I don't I don't have my body wash with me because it's in my suitcase still. Um, I'm here at camp, and so, you know, i got to bring my stuff with me, and it's in a suitcase. So, um, this is um, my shampoo I've been using. I use Herbal Essences um, because it's the best, of course. Um, this is um, Color Me Happy. It's because I use, I have colored hair. Um, it's like, a, right now, it's like strawberry blonde. But um, this is um, for shampoo, and it's got Moroccan rose and passion fruit in it. It smells like, like fruity shampoo. It doesn't smell like, <laughs> it doesn't smell like, I don't know, Moroccan roses or passion fruit. But I think it smells like fruity shampoo. Um, it says... Uh, come on and get happy. It gives you um, hints for how to get like brighter eyes and that kind of thing. And um, it says it's supposed to re reveal the natural shine. Uh, sadly, this does not work on my color because every time I dye my hair like a red tone, it comes out and leaves me with like this strawberry blonde. So sad day. It's not a shampoo's fault. It's my hair's fault. It doesn't like to hold on to red. Um, but this is the um, conditioner I use and it's herbal essences also and it's um, hello hydration actually what's in this bottle is a mix of a couple of um, conditioners but I don't remember what I put all in here but I do use the hello hydration is also in this bottle um, it's got Hawaiian coconut and orchid in it and I can tell you straight up you can so smell the coconut, which makes me so happy. I love coconut shampoos. I used to use Suave a lot when I was younger, and I always used, like, the tropical coconut stuff. Um, it's supposed to, like, it's a rich conditioner that indulges you from root to tip, moving moisture from your hair to your parched, quenched strands. It's a sip of fat satisfaction. Um, and, like, I usually just massage this into my hair, and then I leave it there for a couple minutes, and then I um, rinse it out. And it leaves my hair really soft, so it's great. I totally recommend both of those. Um, I don't really know if the color stuff works because the color always comes out of my hair. So I can't, <laughs> can't tell you. But um, moving on, I have uh, my toothbrush and toothpaste with me. Uh, toothbrush. I love Hello Kitty stuff. I rarely buy myself anything Hello Kitty, but I did buy myself this. This is a toothbrush. It's got, my favorite part is the suction cup and the cover. Uh, it came with a toothbrush cover on it, and it's got a suction cup so you can, like, stick it onto stuff. Like my laptop. I hope that worked. Um, so... That's my toothbrush, and then the toothbrush paste I'm currently using, because I like these containers the best for going to camp, is 2-in-1 toothpaste and mouthwash, because who has time to do mouthwash when you're in camp? Um, and it's Colgate, the whitening with stain lifters, because I have really not white teeth at all, and so um, I'm working on getting them white again. <laughs> um, this next product is, I have like kind of, smelly-ish feet and so this is what I use for that and this is gold bond body powder you know you just sprinkle it into your shoes it smells like gold bond yes terrible um this is the my favorite deodorant it's suave and I'm not going to take the cap off um <laughs> it's kind of old looking but it's not that old it survived college for most part, like, it's getting down to its last days. But it's, um, Invisible Solid, and it's in my favorite scent, which is Tropical Paradise. It smells like coconut. I mentioned earlier, I love the smell of coconuts. 
coconut and pineapple kind of going rocking there. It's like a pina colada in your arm. <laughs> uh, it's 24 hour protection. It does work. It's cheap. It's a done deal. Um, trying to think of what I haven't shown you yet. This is my hairbrush. It's really cool. It's got some hair in it right now. I've had this hairbrush for three years and it's never failed me. It's a con air. Um, this is after I shower. I always put this in my hair. It's Paul Mitchell Express Style. Uh, it's seventeen dollars for this bottle. So if you're going to get it, get it. It's totally worth it. Um, it's you put it in your hair after you get a shower, and it helps dry it faster. It's called Fast Form Cream Gel. It helps your hair dry faster, and um, it also helps like if you style your hair after you dry it, it like helps it hold that. It's like pre-gel for your hair. And then if you put it in when, when you're about to style, it also helps hold that too. So you can put it in once, twice, whenever. Um, it You put it on when it's wet and you can put it on when it's dry too. Uh, it smells... It smells like... It's kind of floral smelling. It's really good. It's nice. It comes out like a cream cream gel, like he said, like it says on the bottle, I'm sorry, <laughs> um, and then I have, this is the perfume I use, and it's War Paint Beauty from Hot Topic, it's a line that just went out of Hot Topic, because they moved Black Heart Beauty in, um, but I sp still love this, it's called Untouchable, and it smells like I like to spray the scent into the cap and then smell it because that helps that you don't have to like spray it everywhere but it smells like citrus with like a light vanilla overtone like orange but like it's not like orange creamsicle like super sweet or creamy or anything it's just got like a vanilla overtone to it it's not like crazy in your face which is good just crazy in your face smells are never good for you. Not good. So, um, that's that. And then the last thing I have to show you is the stuff I use on my face. Um, which is, uh, Rapid Clear by Neutrogena. Uh, two in one, it's fight and fade. And so, oh, it's a toner. That's the word I forgot earlier. Toner. I actually use this at night, um, before I go to bed. And I use it, uh, right before I put on my makeup. I let it dry and then I put on my makeup. Um, and what it does is it fights breakouts in under eight hours and it fades the look of post acne marks so it helps get rid of the scarring while fighting your new acne. Which is really nice. I love this. I put this on after I clean my face and I clean my face with Saint Ive. Um, this is new stuff I'm using actually. I used to use the apricot scrub and it wasn't really doing anything for me. But this stuff is working pretty good. Um, I obviously still have some acne going on, but it's like it is cleaning that up. It was worse two days ago. Um, it's from their naturally clean thing, and they're both green tea scrubs. This is a scrub. I usually scrub first. Uh, no, I usually clean my face first. This is the cleanser. You put it on, and then you wipe it off. I usually clean my face, and then I scrub it to get any excess dirt out. Um, I scrub at night before I go to bed, um, and I cleanse, you're supposed to use it two times a day, so I do it in the morning and the evening. So, those are all the hygiene products I have with me. Thanks for watching. Comment below if you use any of these products, what you think about these products, do you love or hate any of these products. 